Today I'll teach you how to use web client in Windows Forms application. So let's start. As you can see on your screen, this is a JSON file. This is a Windows form. Now I'm adding a text box to the form and I'm setting the multi line to true. Let's move to the code behind. So here I am adding a namespace system.net. Now inside the form load event handler. Here I am setting a property expect 100 continue to true. This particular property belongs to the service point manager class. The second property is security protocol and it also belongs to the service point manager class. Now further you will notice I have created an object of web client class and I am making use of the download string method of the web client class to call the API on GitHub. I have passed the URL of the API to the download string method and the result which is is actually a JSON string is being captured in a string variable and finally I'm assigning the JSON string to text box and now it's time to run our project and see it in action as you can see the text box is populated with data from the JSON data that's it